Three months ago, I showed you guys this valve. It's called the Aladdin Easy Fit Isolator Valve. Now this one is unusual. You can install this on a fully pressurized plumbing line and within five minutes, you can instantly stop the flow of water and you end up with a permanent valve. Now that video got a lot of views and over 2000 comments and most of them were to tell me that I made a couple of mistakes. So in this video, I'm gonna answer the technical questions you guys asked and show you one of the biggest mistakes that I made that involves a competitor's product. I had actually thought the Aladdin valve was the only one of its kind, but here we're looking at another one made by the company Jomar. And I installed one of these on this test pipe and it will do the same job as the Aladdin valve, but it cost almost $500. So while it is true that I was incorrect about saying the Aladdin valve was the only one of its kind, I don't think this is a better option, especially for a DIYer. No, the Aladdin valve is not a type of saddle valve. Now these valves can often be illegal in many towns and cities, but fortunately this thing is different. When you use it, the cutter actually cuts away a complete section of the pipe. It does this while under pressure, and then as you can see in this cutaway, it actually pushes the section of the pipe into the bottom of the valve. And those pieces will remain there permanently, and they are not in the flow of water, and they won't cause any type of restrictions. Now if you didn't watch that first video, as you're drilling into the pipe, it clearly is making some shavings of copper, and people wanted to know where'd all those bits go? Are you gonna clog up your dishwasher or other filters in your house? The cutter inside, which is made of stainless steel, is called a swarfless cutter. Now it is certainly cutting through the pipe, but it's designed to produce a very minimal amount of shavings. It is still a good idea to flush out your lines when you're done with the job. The valve is a permanent solution. Once you put it in place, it's set it and forget it, and you can instantly stop the flow of water. Many of the comments talked about how cool this valve was, but that it was too expensive. Now I totally agree, but this is a well-made valve, and if you consider the competitor's valve is about 30% more expensive, I don't think the price on this thing is gonna lower anytime soon. There were many questions from folks saying, why not just use your water main? Well, if you've got one, you don't need to buy this valve at all. This is a last resort valve, meaning you don't have access to your water main, or you might have a situation where you've got a rental, maybe half your building needs to have the water turned off. If you use one of these, you could stop the flow of water anytime without interrupting the main service. Plumbers today are not cheap and they're really difficult to get. A lot of the people that are buying this type of valve are doing it because they just can't get anyone else to come out and they wanna be able to do the job themselves. I'm not recommending that you go out and buy this valve to replace a regular shutoff valve that might be as little as 10 bucks. Again, if you can shut the flow of water off another way, just go ahead and put a regular valve in place. And if you wanna see me install this valve from start to finish, you can click on the link in the upper right hand corner and you can see how I put one of these in my own house. If you wanna know more about this valve or I didn't cover something, be sure to leave me a comment below and subscribe to the Silver Symbol channel for more videos coming up.